Hey everybody, this, vi this video tutorial is going to show you guys how to specifically get Mass Effect to work on your computer, um, but it could also work for any other game that was made in 2007 or earlier, such as Elder Scrolls 3, Elder Scrolls 4, uh, pretty well any game that I have on the right, plus you can think of your Dragon Age as you follow 3, it's just games that were made earlier than 2007 that for some reason won't open, won't load, or they crash in your computer. Very first thing you want to do is attempt to open the launcher in administrator mode. Now, some people have been reporting that you need to run Steam in administrator mode as well. So, you'd obviously right-click your Steam, run it as administrator. Now, when you open up Steam, the, the very first thing that Steam gives you is a shortcut to the game, not to the launcher. So, you need to go right-click on Mass Effect, go to Properties, Local Files, Browse Local Files. Now, that'll just bring you into where it is in your computer. And you can see right here you got launcher, Mass Effect launcher. What you want to run as administrator is the Mass Effect launcher. So you'd right click, click that, run as administrator. I'm not going to do it because I got the game loaded right now. Uh, but a window will quickly pop up that says play, configure, yada, yada, yada. Just hit play. And if the game works, perfect. That's all you have to do from now on is run the game as administrator. Now, what I would do if I were you, get rid of the Mass Effect shortcut that was there. Create a Mass Effect launcher shortcut and then bring that onto your desktop as I have. That way when you double click your Mass Effect shortcut or right click to run as administrator, it'll open up the launcher rather than the game. Now if that doesn't work, second thing we're going to do is we're going to upload, not upload, we're going to update Mass Effect. Now when you buy Mass Effect off of Origin or Steam, it actually doesn't uh, update it to the newest version. The newest version of Mass Effect's uh, up, Mass Effect's update strictly dealt with the load issues or the startup issues that were happening uh, happening on PCs. So I'm going to put the link in the description, but you can see right here it's a Bioware file, files.bioware.com. So it is specifically a Bioware update, so you don't need to worry about it being third party. And all you got to do is hit continue to external site. It'll I'll just click it, whatever. You can see it it automatically loads uploads the download. Now when that opens up, you just hit accept, yes, I accept, yada yada, just like any other install that you would do. And it'll ask you if you want to see the patch notes. If you want, hit yes, and it'll just open up a notepad file on your computer and you can read what the what the update did. Now, go out of your game, run the launcher. Uh, you may have to restart Steam or restart your computer. I don't remember. Um, if you do, then just do it. Um, and then you right click your launcher again, hit run as administrator. Hit play. Now, if the game doesn't load this time, then you need to upload or download a NVIDIA Legacy driver. Now, what this driver does is it allows you to play games that were made in 2007 or earlier. Why is this the last thing that we're doing? Because some computers don't need the Legacy driver, but if you have a computer like mine, you need the Legacy driver. Once again, I'll put the description or the link in the description. It's just this NVIDIA driver right here. You download it. And it strictly says, sorry, it specifically says uh, this is for games made in 2000 or early, 2007 or earlier. Now install that. Once again, might have to restart your computer. And all you got to do, right click Mass Effect Launcher, run as administrator. And after you've done these three steps, the game should load. I hope this helped. Like, comment, subscribe. If you have any questions, comment. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks, guys.